Hey everybody, Steven here. Um, I haven't shot some content for this channel in a while just because I've been super busy uh, with a whole bunch of other different projects. I'll put a link, I started a YouTube channel for our publishing company. This is one of the shirts. Uh, we make kids books, the company's called Oddball Publishing. Um, so I've been busy with that, but this is still the tech side of what I like to do and the video game side of what I like to do. Um, the other thing I've been waiting on actually to shoot more content too is my S-Move mobile. So I got the uh, Zayun gimbal, um, Zayun 4 or something like that, and I didn't want to um, mess with that after I saw this product. I got it for three days and then this showed up on my feed and it actually has the main feature that I want which is the ability for this to face detect and then track my motion. That way I'm not having to hire a cameraman or pay just a ton of money for um, some of those uh, different um, products that actually have that feature with it. I started to open this, I was like, man, I need to shoot a video for it though. So, this is the S-Move Mobile. Let's go and pull this out. All right, put that right there. All right, user manual. Ah, it does come with I was worried about the case, so it does come with the case. That is awesome. We have charging cord, some adapters. Oh, that's nice. So various adapters if you need it. What are these? Oh, this is so you can, if you need to plug in multiple devices, I think, right there. Uh, just a hand uh, tie deal. And then the tripod, which is right here, which is actually smaller than I thought it was going to be. But uh, my camera is actually on my uh, Zomi um, tripod, so I'm hoping that this will function with that very, very nicely. But let's go and open this up. Boom. All right, there it is. So we have um, on the back end here, uh, decent rubber grip. You have your trigger button. We have record, power, USB on the side here. Um, I'm assuming this is a zoom function on the side right over here. Um, this moves around, so we'll see what that does. I'm gonna have to obviously mess around with this a little bit. Uh, let's see, quick start guide. You need to charge or move insert and balance your phone, power on. Um, yeah, I don't think this is gonna, oh, no, there it goes. Woo, this one makes a noise too. There we go. Uh, so my phone is actually recording, so I can't do that. We have our USB port down here, so you can cho charge your phone from this, which one of the other features, a lot of them have it. I saw that and I really liked it. Um, adjustable base here uh, it turned off there's nothing in it um, it doesn't have as many little features here as that uh, and I'm probably mispronouncing that but that Zayun 4 deal had uh, smooth 4 that the name of the company was Zayun or something like that but smooth 4 um, with that but I'll have to play around with this and see like I said the main draw was the auto face detection with that and if I can see it, because this up, this also had, I don't know how I'll do that. Oh, whoa, there we go. Which was that feature, which is that it would actually extend out like that. Because if I'm putting it on a base, if I can prop it up on something, or hopefully I can prop it up on this, which I should be able to, um, now I can extend this a little bit further. Or if I'm doing handheld stuff like this, that is pretty sweet. And then you just shove it back down. I didn't go with the Pro. This is just the regular. Pro is a little bit more expensive. As far as I know, and I haven't looked too much into it other than what I just saw on the website, it's really just the build material of it is uh, a little bit uh, more quality. This is plastic. Um, that other one is, is metal, um, so less likely to break. But I'm gonna put a link for this also. And then this is just really the unboxing video. I'm gonna make another video showing some of the stuff and I'm gonna to toy around with it. And then that'll be a separate one that I'll also put at the end of this video so you guys can watch that. Um, See, not a ton of other videos with people that do way more in depth stuff than me. So if you're looking for that, that isn't gonna be this video or the next one. I'm just an amateur playing around with this stuff, having fun. 
um, this is really going to serve me well for my personal training content also because with the auto face detection and the tracking now I can click on my face I can do the exercises where I'm actually moving in space more now and uh, this is going to follow me so I'll be interested to try that out and then show you guys that as well so if you guys like the video hit the like button for me um, I'll put a uh, link for this as well so that you guys can find this if you're you're interested in this um, the only downside that I found with the company so far because I, I did start to see some of the negative reviews and comments and all that is that uh, the thing I experienced I guess I, I didn't spell my address correctly I spelled Orc Ridge instead of Oak Ridge and because of that it wasn't shipping out well I'd hit them up because it was taking forever to ship to me and finally like person was like oh, oh is this your correct address it's kicking back and saying that it's not an address I was like, well, somebody should have contacted me if that was the case. And uh, I didn't. I just hadn't heard from them. I had to hit them up four times before I was able to find that out. And then it got here in three days. So um, that is the video, guys. Hit the like button if you like the video. Hit the subscribe button if you want to continue to follow along. Like I said, I'm going to pump out a couple more videos showing me just toying around with that. That way these aren't crazy long. Thanks for watching, guys.